Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Yong Gang Ying. I'm from Tsinghua University, China. Uh, I'm from the same uh, research group with the last uh, speaker, Mr. Fang. He has already introduced the, the uh, noise performance of our accelerometers. Uh, now I'm going to talk about the uh, temperature intensity, uh, temperature drift of our accelerometer. Uh, the title of my presentation is a temperature insensitive micro machine resonant accelerometer with thermal stress isolation. Uh, the presentation is divided into four parts. Firstly, uh, introduction of the accelerometer. Uh, uh, secondly, problem of the temperature drift. Thirdly, methods of uh, to decrease the temperature drift. And lastly, the measured results. Um, MEMS accelerometers have been used in many kinds of applications. Uh, for civilian products, the precision of the accelerometer is often over 1 mini g, um, where, where g means gra uh, gravitational ac acceleration. The precision of the accelerometers in the air plan and tactical, uh, tactical grade application uh, is between 10 micro g and uh, uh, 1 mini g. Our accelerometers uh, and to be used in high precision inertial navigation and the gravity measurement. The precision need to be below 10 micro g. Uh, micro machine resonant accelerometer for short MRA is based on the frequency, a uh, force to frequency characteristics of high Q resonators. It's very attractive due to its large dynamic range and high precision. Uh, the structure is symmetrical. Uh, the difference of the the difference of the two resonator frequency uh, represents the input acceleration. However, the frequency of the resonant beam is not only affected by the uh, acceleration but also affected by the temperature. Uh, the temperature drift of the bias and the scale factor limit the long term stability of the MRA. Uh, there are two major sources uh, of structure temperature drift. Firstly, the Young's modulus of silicon. Uh, secondly, the thermal stress generated during the SOG process and the die attach process. Uh, the first error can be greatly decreased by a differential design, but the second one is unpredictable and will worsen the differential effect. Uh, this paper proposed uh, an improved uh, structure design and uh, an isolation substrate to reduce the thermal stress. Uh, the MRA was fabricated uh, by silicon and glass process. Uh, since the coefficients of thermal stress, uh, thermal expansion uh, of the glass substrate is larger than that of the silicon uh, structure. The x-axis distance uh, between the anchors will increase as the, time, uh, as the temperature rises. In this case, the natural frequency of the resonant beam will increase due to the tensile force. Uh, if, if the distance is zero, the uh, thermal stress along the x-axis uh, along the x-axis can be decreased greatly and so we used an inverted beam here uh, the layout of the suspension beams uh, can also uh, influence the thermal stress uh, the anchor four anchors of the sus suspension beams uh, should be arranged symmetrically and uh, close to each other this is uh, an improved structure design. Uh, the simulation results show that the drift of a single resonator is uh, negative 0 0.576 hertz per degree centigrade, which is uh, most owing to the Young's modular drift. And the, uh, uh, and the thermal uh, the, the frequency drift uh, caused by the thermal expansion is only 
uh, negative 0 0.016 hertz per degree centigrade. Um, however, this uh, this result will be in, uh, affected by the traditional die attach process. Mm, we uh, we package the glass substrate on the ceramic base. Uh, the expansion of the uh, adhesive layer will generate exceptional uh, thermal stress, and the adhesive layer is often uneven. So the uh, simulated uh, results will be affected. To solve this problem, we proposed an edge-shaped uh, isolation sub uh, structure to reduce the thermal stress during the packaging. Uh, the silicon structure is isolated, uh, 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 isolated by the uh, adhesive layer by a, uh, a narrow isolation beam. And uh, this is the photo of, of the fabricated devices. The device is uh, fabricated by laser cutting. Uh, we have compared two kinds of substrate shapes, uh, rectangular substrate and the edge-shaped substrate. Pay attention to the uh, maximum stress of the silicon area. Uh, the stress of the rectangular substrate is uh, 2. 1 mega Pascal, and the uh, stress of the edge shaped substrate is only 0 0.50 mega Pascal. The simulation results show that the edge shaped substrate can effectively uh, isolate the thermal stress. Then the structure was sealed in a mechanical package and uh, maintained at a high vacuum by a gate inside the package. Uh, the Q factor is about uh, uh, 215,000. The experimental setup is shown in this figure. Uh, the circuits uh, include uh, capacitive position sensing and uh, closed loop control. Uh, the output signal was measured by uh, frequency counters, the, and the sampling frequency is 1 hertz. Um, the prototype was tested on the uh, four constant uh, temperature, uh, 30, 40, 50, and the 60 degrees centigrade. Um, this is a photo of the test equipment. This is a turn table. This is the temperature controlled chamber. Uh, the, the temperature ca characteristics of three mild MRA devices are shown in this, this table. Uh, we can see that uh, the mirror temperature drift coefficients agree well with the simulated prediction where the discrepancy is below 3%. And the uh, based TDC is only about 10 micro G per degree centigrade. Uh, let's see more measurement results of the of one typical prototype M1. Uh, the mirrored temperature drift of M1 is shown in this figure. Uh, F1 and F2 uh, represent the resonant frequency of two resonators, respectively. Uh, the difference of the F1 F and the F2 represent the uh, output acceleration. The temperature drift of the uh, of the differential output is only uh, negative 0 0.0034 hertz per degree centigrade. The prototype is tested for 12 hours on the room temperature. Uh, the standard deviation of the later 10-hour data is uh, 2.7 micro g. And the fire stability of the uh, latest uh, one, uh, last one hour output is only uh, 0 0.7 micro G. Here, uh, uh, note that 
the, there is no temperature compensation of data smoothing uh, are used in this figure. Here we give the late, uh, latest work of our work. Uh, we have increased the, the scale factor to 364 hertz per G and decreased the, the drift of the interface electronics um, during 15 days. Uh, the buyer stability of, the, of our latest prototype is only about one micro G. Uh, this experiment was also performed on the room temperature. Uh, the MRA can achieve high precision even without the uh, temperature compensation when the temperature of the room uh, fluctuates.